right, so turning our Easy Drama MIDI into audio, so setting it up, how do we do it? So um, let's just close this up and then we start with a new project, I open up a new project, I select uh, 17 tracks um, and then open up your mixer, uh, insert Easy Drama 2, all right. So the first track will be your uh, select symbol audio and MIDI together. So your first track will be your main Easy Drama track. That's where your Easy Drama output is coming from into the, all the other tracks that you're going to. So you can rename that to your main. All right. And then you can mute it if you want to, but there will be sound that will... So all the tracks are currently just in, on this all the drums outputs are currently just on this one track so what we want to do is we want to put them all in different your kick your snare your hi-hats your toms all of them in different uh, tracks so you then you come at the in and then you select uh, your first in as easy drama uh, easy one and then you go you select uh, the second uh, sorry you go and you select the ins instrument output your second one and then you go on like that the third one and then you go to the fourth one, the fifth one. That's basically what you do until you reach, uh, what was this one? Um, that's one, two, three, four, five, that's right. So you will have your kick up here. Uh, that's what um, what we will name it as. You can change the names as, uh, because you will select a different uh, drum kit and so on. So uh, that means that it will change every time okay but this is for this specific drum kit that i have okay so they say toms up here um, and then this is the fifth one uh the fourth one and then i think you have your overheads up here all right so if we open up easy drama let's just quickly open it up come on okay good and then we go to our mixer for an easy drama then you'll see that's where your first kick is okay so we don't need to change that one then you go to number two output here number three and then you say four and then you say five those are your overheads okay and then you can go up to six you can rename basically all of them but what you must remember is that every time you select a different drum uh, these um, channels or outputs will change according to to what you have uh, selected okay so my all right like that uh, a little bit less and and so on so um, yeah so let's go back to my original one so that's this is the one that I have and then you can rename all the tracks in that way so now you have got all your, your drums you have your kick your kick up here then you've got your snare and then you've got your hi-hats all of them in here and then you've got your toms all in here and then you've got your overheads all of them up in here all right so you have set it up in that way so you can go all the way up there so you can basically uh, control your volume up here your everything you can just control easy drama up from there and then you can record also audio through it um, and which is very helpful so if we just record that and uh, not the first main one so all of them is uh, let's just okay then let's just play or play on my keyboard up here this up here uh, let's just go up here let's get rid of that It's recorded in audio now so when we play it we can hear it awesome great as you can see there it is up there all right so I hope this was helpful uh, save it as a template and I hope you continue making good music thank you very much